In this 3 minute game review, we're looking at Diluvian Winds. So hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. Diluvian Winds is an early access 2D base building survival game where you must build a lighthouse that survives the elements. Diluvian Winds has a quirky but cute hand-drawn art style that is distinct and easy on the eyes. The game also has a calming and soothing soundtrack to match its well-mixed ambient and environmental sounds. At first glance, Diluvian Winds might seem like your run-of-the-mill, cozy base builder game. However, despite being easy to learn, the game eventually becomes really tough to manage as more and more options and species open up through your progress in the story. The main gameplay loop is delegating tasks to travelers that stay at your lighthouse to either build, forage resources, or dismantle rooms that make up your main structure, whilst keeping the fire burning from atop the lighthouse. Losing this fire means losing the game, so you'll have to seriously manage your fuel supplies as things like windy or stormy weather causes it to go out much faster. Once every couple of days, a caravan will come to pick up your old travelers and drop off new travelers of various species, each with their own pros and cons, and part of the fun is in actually managing the kind of travelers you get whilst juggling with the weather conditions over the next couple of days, as it can affect the kind of resource bonus or disadvantages that you get, with the worst kind of weather resulting in a huge tidal wave that if not adequately prepared for, will wreck your base into an irrecoverable state. As the story progresses, you unlock new projects to build and unique requests and conversations from your guests, which also unlock blueprints and new technologies to help you manage and survive the worsening weather as the days go by. The game may not have a strong and obvious storyline, but the story progression and new areas and species do shed some light as to the background and history of the world. As far as gameplay goes, Diluvian Winds is definitely not a walk in the park. Even on the normal difficulty, it is tough trying to keep up with the worsening weather, as well as having to constantly repair and reinforce your structures. Not to mention, there is also a heavy element of RNG as sometimes back-to-back -back storms and tidal waves could leave you no room to recover, and thus potentially end an otherwise great run. In the late game, as the days go by, a lot of the micromanagement which actually felt fun at the beginning of the game started to feel slightly tedious and also repetitive at times, especially with many of the transitions between the different phases of the day made the days feel slow and draggy. I wish there was a point where I could automate some of these functions and perhaps move on to bigger and more important tasks, like focusing on building the new areas instead of constantly having to repair and reinforce my structures. That said, for the most part, Diluvian Winds felt fun and as an early access title, feels like it has a ton of potential. However, at this point, I would have to recommend fans of base building games to wait for more updates and balance patches before buying Diluvian Winds, or otherwise, give its free demo a try. If you're craving for more base building or story driven games, check out our other videos. Otherwise, like and subscribe for more 3 minute game reviews.